Thank you so much, Patrick. Space exploration has captured the attention of people all around the world for years. Well, this afternoon, our attention will again be in the sky as a unique launch occurs. Lauren Vizza has more on what's trending today. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning, Stephanie. Well, you're right. Today, we launch and go to space again. Not every day that you get to talk about that, so it's very exciting. An American astronaut and a Russian astronaut are going up together for a year into space in the International Space Station, and that will happen later on this afternoon. Scott Kelly is the American astronaut, and the purpose of this, of this flight, of this trip, it's one year in space, and the purpose is to test the effects that living in space can have for a long time with hopes of learning to combat those kind of physical ailments and what can happen to you about your bones, your vision, things like that, because they're wanting to, you know, start making deeper trips into space, to Mars, things like that, and you can't really do that if, you know, you don't know how to how to take care of yourself and what the effects are. And what's unique about this trip is it's the longest that an American astronaut has ever been in space, 342 days to be exact. And it's the first time that they're comparing his health with his twin back at home. Uh, Mark Kelly is his brother's name, a retired astronaut. And also, he is married to former um, Congresswoman Gabri Gabrielle Gifford, who survived the uh, deadly shooting in 2011. But it's really interesting. So he's going to be at home and taking these tests. They're going to be studying him and then uh, find out what happens when he comes back and compare it to his brother's state of health. And it's, it's going to be really interesting. The flight takes off today, uh, this afternoon, 342, exactly, exactly the amount of days that they will be in space, Eastern time from Kazakhstan. So a very interesting experience, trip. I'm really looking forward to seeing the studies that come back because you never too. know what kind of health things we can discover as well. Yeah, and it's pretty cool. Like you said, one year and one thing to note about that too. Um, who, talk about who his roommate will be. Is a, a Russian astronaut right. who has, they have both made uh, trips of six months tours in the space station. And so it's really interesting that the United States and Russia are able to partner and show that, you know, regardless of other things going on, they're able to partner in this and for the benefit of the world, essentially. Yeah, so true. Mm -hmm. All in the name of space exploration. Yeah, very exciting stuff. Yeah, I like it. Thanks so much, Lauren. Mm -hmm.